Hello friend, welcome to my YouTube channel Mechanical Design Adda. In this video, we will discuss how we can take the image file in the drawing, okay, in Creo. So if you see here, the this drawing contains the image file. I imported here the image here. So there are two ways we can import the image in the drawing. So let's discuss. So this is a PDF file, but I want here the only the table here. So just need to uh, take a snap here. So I'm taking the snap here, okay, and just save to the your location, okay. Here I will save here, like uh, I'll give the name table here on the desktop, okay. I saved the snap here, and after that just go in the drawing. So this is this one I'm showing the first method, okay. Just click on the image. After that, import. Okay, and select the file from the desktop. Okay, this file is in PNG. Okay, okay, and say open. So now you can see that this is the simplest method, and you can zoom and zoom out like that. So uh, this first method maintain the aspect ratio. You can say that is log aspect ratio. Okay, so. It is a in the aspect ratio means that uh, width and height uh, it is proportionate. Okay, so uh, don't uh, unlock this one because we we need to maintain this uh, aspect ratio. Okay, proportionate it will increase or it will zoom or zoom out like that. Okay, but uh, here uh, these are some options are here. If you click on this one, you can set the transparency here like fifty percent. So you can change the transparency, but uh, but keep on zero percent. If uh, the requirement is uh, transparent, then you can uh, use this one. Okay, you can rotate from here, just uh, clockwise, anti-clockwise, like that. And these are some options you can uh, means uh, uh, change the width and height uh, as per your um, uh, convenient. But uh, don't uh, use this one. Just keep the aspect ratio. Okay, so uh, save this one. Okay, say okay. And to change anything here, or you need to delete, or need to add anything, just click on the image here. After that, it will select, and you can perform the means here. You can right click, you can delete here. Okay, remove. Okay, like also from here also you can remove, hide, like that you can do. But in the image window only. Okay. Uh, but here in the drawing window, you can you can't uh, select the image file here. Okay. For that purpose, you need to go into image. So now we will discuss the second type. Okay, so I am removing this one and say okay. So the second uh, uh, way you can import the image file here e e from the object. Okay, so click on the object. Okay, click on the object and go down and here you will get the option paint brush picture. Okay, click on okay. So after that it will open the Uh, paint okay after the, uh, so you can capture the means uh, uh, copy this uh, page uh, whatever you has taken the snip you can just copy and here you need to go here window and say paste okay so it will show you and just save this one okay just save and cancel okay cancel and here you will get okay click on the uh, you can click on anywhere in the drawing window and after but here you can you, uh, this file is in not in the aspect ratio directly we imported but this file is not in the aspect ratio you can see you can move drag like that okay so but it is not in the aspect ratio okay uh, means you can do like this also it is not in in the aspect ratio okay but But here you will get the uh, means high resolution image. Okay, so if you want to use this option, uh, don't use this one. Okay, don't drag from this side. Just drag from this side only. Okay, like that. Like that you need to uh, drag. Okay, not like this. Okay, don't do like this. Okay, uh, because here you won't get the uh, aspect ratio option here. Okay. so the these are the two ways you can import the image into the drawing file if you like this video you can like share and subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon see you in the next video thank you for watching